Pearl Valley is continuing a 24 hour sit in on the House floor. She's pushing for changes to gun laws. Representative Aaron May Quaid began this sit in at 1130 on Tuesday morning. The Apple Valley Democrat is demanding that several gun reform bills at least go up for a vote before lawmakers. At least 26 different gun safety bills have been introduced in 2018, including measures on universal background checks. Only two of those got a hearing, and they were both defeated. There is a wide loophole that allows people to purchase guns privately and not go through a background check. Guns kill people, and to possess something that can kill people, we should know that you're lawfully allowed to possess it. The day-long sit-in has drawn the respect of pro-gun advocates, but not their support when it comes to voting on gun bills. Criminals are already circumventing the current background check process to acquire firearms. Adding additional layers to that is only going to affect law-abiding citizens, not criminals. Door claims 95% of its members are against the proposed legislation and says the opposition to the bills comes from both parties. On Saturday, several thousand gun owners are expected at the state capitol to rally against gun control. Now, throughout her sit in, Representative May Quaid is reading the names and stories of gun violence victims in our state. She said even if this sit in does nothing for the legislation, at least she will be able to tell those stories. As May joins us once again, very dramatic, getting a lot Absolutely. of headlines, news coverage. Uh, Republican leaders haven't said anything about this. Any right. chance this is going to do anything? You know, I, I don't think it is going to do anything, but this is sort of another salvo in this whole issue of will voters in November vote on this issue? Mm -hmm. And it is up to all our viewers here on both sides what are they going to do, but certainly dramatic. And I also think it is something to watch for Aaron McQuaid. I think this is a star that is at the DFL party, and I think you're going to hear a lot more from her in coming years. Mm -hmm. And we've already been hearing more from Absolutely. her. Absolutely. Uh, let's turn now to talk.